National Assembly elections were held in Bhutan for the first time on 24 March 2008. Two parties were registered by the Election Commission of Bhutan to contest the election, the Bhutan Peace and Prosperity Party DPT, for Druk Funzam Tishagpa, which was formed by the merger of the previously established Bhutan People's United Party and All People's Party and is led by Jigma Y. Thinley, and the People's Democratic Party PDP. The third political party, the Bhutan National Party BNP, had its application for the registration cancelled. Electoral system The elections for the 47 seats of the National Assembly were planned to be held in two rounds. In the first round, voters would have voted for a party. The two parties with the largest share of the national vote would then have been able to field candidates in the 47 constituencies. However, as only two parties successfully registered for the election, the election was held in one round. Topic Background Topic Mock Elections On the twenty first of April two thousand seven, a mock election was held to prepare the population of Bhutan for the imminent change to democracy. These elections were held in all 47 National Assembly constituencies and at 869 polling stations with around 1,000 voters at each one of them. The parties contesting the election were the Druk Blue Party, the Druk Green Party, the Druk Red Party and the Druk Yellow Party with Druk being Zonka for Thunder Dragon, each of them representing certain values as their party manifesto. Yellow for traditional values, red for industrial development, blue for fairness and accountability, and green for the environment. The two parties winning the most votes were to proceed to a runoff election scheduled for 28 May. Election observers were present from the United Nations and from India. The results of the first round saw the Druk Yellow Party receive a plurality of the vote. The two leading parties, Druk Yellow Party and Druk Red Party, put up randomly chosen high school students as candidates in the 47 constituencies in the second round on 28 May 2007. The Druk Yellow Party swept the vote and won 46 of the 47 constituencies. Turnout in the second round was 66%. 283,506 people had registered to vote, though it is considered likely that a total of 400,000 would have been eligible to register as voters. Schedule The election procedure began with the submission of the letters of intent, lists of candidates, copies of election manifestos and audited financial statements by the two political parties contesting the elections to the Election Commission followed by the release of the party manifestos by them on of January 2008. From 31 January to 7 February 2008 both political parties submitted the nomination papers for their candidates for the 47 constituencies. The candidates, whose nominations were accepted, started campaigning in their constituencies from 7 February. The election campaign ended at 9 o'clock on of March. The last date for receiving the postal ballots was 18 February. The elections were held on 24 March from 9 o'clock to 1700 followed by the counting of ballots on the same day. The results were declared on the 25th of March. All eligible voters were allowed to register with the Election Commission until the 20th of February 2008 for the inclusion of their names in the voters list which was updated to include those eligible voters who were 18 years old on or before the 1st of January 2008. The final electoral roll was published on the 5th of March 2008. Topic: Results Turnout reached nearly 80% by the time the polls closed, and the Bhutan Peace and Prosperity Party reportedly won 44 seats, with the People's Democratic Party winning only three seats Funcholing in Chukka, Genkato Laya in Gasa and Sambuka in Haa. The PDP's leader, Sangay Engtup, who was also the ruling king's uncle, lost his own constituency by 380 votes. 
Reportedly, there were few differences between the platforms of the two parties, which might explain the unexpectedly uneven results. Analysts were worried that the small representation of the opposition might have obstructed the functioning of the newly founded democratic system, but this does not to appear to have happened, as power peacefully changed hands after the People's Democratic Party won the 2013 National Assembly elections. Both parties had pledged to follow the king's guidelines of pursuing gross national happiness and both party leaders had previously served in governments another attempt to explain the bppp's large scale victory is that it is apparently the more royalist of the two parties an explanation popularly given by bhutanese in the days leading up to the election for the lack of support for the people's democratic party was that it would encourage corruption and be contrary to the king's request for the bhutanese to form a popular government to elect leadership having as was popularly believed about the pdp strong personal ties to both the king and bhutanese business Due to a mistake in tallying the votes and funcholing, it turned out that actually, the BPPP had won 45 seats and the PDP only two. The two PDP members who were elected have refused to take up their seats and resigned their mandates, claiming that the civil servants informally campaigned for the DPT and thus greatly influenced the result. The DPT officially approved its leader as candidate for PM on 5 April 2008. He took office on 9 April. 